What's up guys? So we are back here and I am jumping into some NFT play to earn game. So this game is called Noah. It is in alpha right now. So this is alpha testing from the devs posted November 11th. And what it is is a uh, like trading card game where you build a deck of cards of 26 cards. 16 of them are hero cards. So these are the hero cards. And then 10 of them are support cards. The support cards you'll flip over to, and those will be your buffs or debuffs for the team, for the game. And then your 16 heroes will start battling your enemy's 16 heroes. Once a hero dies, uh, the hero is then replaced at the end of the turn. One turn is when everyone takes an action. So these heroes have abilities. You can see the abilities are going back and forth, doing special effects like bleeds and blinds, AoE damage you know, critical hit chances and stuff like that and so forth. You have healers as well that are healing. You have mages. It's like that That one just did a AOE effect to hit those three and ended up killing this one over here. So this is the game. In the future, they are going to add effects where you can click on skills and abilities and do active gameplay, which that's what I'm really looking forward to. They also are going to have PvP. They're going to have tournaments and leaderboards. So they do have a roadmap with pretty detailed information on what's going to happen, and it is all happening pretty quickly. We're able to actually jump into the beta in the middle of December, so you'll see some beta footage from me playing this game. Uh, beta is going to be the start of the game, so if you want to jump in and, and get in the ground level floor, you jump in at the beta level, and you start play to earn, you know, potentially earning a lot of money that could be very, very valuable in the coming weeks and months. So if the game blows up, like... Your currency that you're earning today could be only worth 10 cents. But, like, if you if the game blows up and in a month that currency is worth $10, you're just like, dang, all those little tokens that I earned have now become incredibly valuable. And so, I do think this has a decent chance to actually blow up big. You can see these are past drops they've given out. So, this was a card that was given out for free. Uh, it was an energy orb. And so, this card currently sells for about $50 right now. And they gave out 190 of these just for free. So, you can see a lot of people are expecting good things out of this. Uh, this super early adapters pack, this is where you got the beta and a uh, mana potion, which boosts your token gains uh, in the game. This sold for $100 and is currently selling for about $400, $500 on the secondary market. And that's the big thing about these NFT games is that you have access to selling everything on the NFT marketplaces. And this is connected to the Atomic Hub, the Wax Marketplace, which is one of the big reasons why I think this game could be huge. Wax is one of the most popular marketplaces and tokens, and we're seeing a huge surge in price. So currently the Wax token is around like 80 or 90 cents. And that, that is up like double value from the last like month. Wax token used to be like 30 cents, 40 cents. And so they just released Hot Wheels. Hot Wheels is now part of the Wax network. You can see these cool NFTs that were released. Uh, Funko Pop is on the NFT market. We also have Farmer's World, which is like the biggest NFT play to earn crypto game currently going on right now, I think. And like people are making hundreds of dollars a day you know, passive income farming on this game. To start this game, though, it's crazy. You have to spend, like, at current prices, like $10,000 to start this game. Um, it's insane. And this game used to be, you know, pennies on the dollar. It used to be, like, you could start the game for 20 bucks, 50 bucks. But now it's, like, $10,000 to start this game. So why I think this is a good choice is these are all the items on the Wax um uh, you know, network here on Atomic Hub, and you can see the rankings there. So Hot Wheels is obviously really hot. It just got released yesterday, but if we keep going down, you can see this is in order of kind of like how much sales and popularity. Uh, Noah is about number 20 right now, and they have nothing. They have nothing but like promos and stickers. Um, the crazy thing is that if you keep going down further, you can see Funko. Funko Pop is actually lower than Noah, and this is the Teenage Minion, Teenage Minion Turtle... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle uh, drop of Funko Pop, and it is actually really low. That was like the most popular Funko drop, and you can just keep going down. There's more Funko drops down here, super low. So Freddy Funko, the Halloween Funko drop, like you have Tops also. So the Tops trading cards, you have Atari. So this game is already way more popular than several big IPs, and the fact 
you know, like all these ones up here in the top are either probably play to earn games or coming soon games like that. People are taking good chances. Splinterlands was a very popular game. Uh, I've heard a lot about that. Alien Worlds was actually a very popular game also, and I think still is. So the fact that Noah is already in the top 20 on Atomic Hub, and we'll show you kind of like what they have, is pretty impressive. The things are holding a lot of value. So you have basic stickers that were given out for free, and those are all like, you know, minimum 20 cents. Like they go up pretty quickly in price. So we're already at 40, 45 cents and they keep going higher and higher. There's some things in here that were given out for free or that you could earn for free uh, that are hundreds of dollars. So like it is very, very impressive what they've done. They've built this network of value in the brand. They have about 5,000 to 10,000 or so members on the Discord. They're doing extremely well for a brand new, you know, company building this from nothing they have collabs and, and they've worked with other teams and other developers the artwork is also pretty cool too so i think the gameplay is decent it's definitely nothing to write home about nothing you're going to be like yeah this is the greatest game ever but for a play to earn game i think this is definitely something to look out for and keep on your radar so noah is releasing soon check this stuff out by the time you see the video you're going to be seeing uh you know the cards on the marketplace and uh, yeah i will talk to you guys later thanks for watching hit that like button subscribe to the channel and i will uh do some more noah gameplay footage and information in the future on this stuff thanks for watching guys i am excited and uh this is not financial advice do your own research check things out it's extremely risky to be investing in cryptocurrencies, especially NFTs.